Poppin' Cat Babies, it's your girl like Kayla Jones, and I'm back with another video bringing you peace. take two of what I already just did I just realized that in my last video like I wasn't really being myself I don't know maybe because of the topic I don't know maybe I, I don't know I gotta see but I've been gone for like two three, four or five days now I know I said I was gonna try to upload every day I've been kind of going through it I've been trying to work on myself a lot y'all also y'all got my glasses I found them I don't know if y'all know this, but yeah, I found my glasses, so I feel really good about them. Because <laughs> now I don't have to wear my contacts so much and put them in my eyes. Because I never feel like putting my contacts or taking them out. Anyways, y'all, I'm sorry. Reason being is because I'm really trying to focus on myself. Don't mind the background. That's my robe. I was putting clothes up, so don't judge. Okay. But, uh, <laughs> not that long ago. It's been about two or three weeks. I got out of a relationship. Even though I'm the one that broke up with the person, I'm still hurt. I'm still sad about it. Um... I have ups and downs and I've been trying to work on myself after and it's been kind of hard. I keep going back and forth on what I should do. Like should I focus on myself or should I just start talking to all these different types of people? You know, so it's kind of hard. Yesterday I kind of, I did bad. I tried to talk to all these different types of people and it's just, it's not me. And I think yesterday once I realized that, you know, that's not you, just really focus on yourself. And when I say focus on myself, my first thing that I started doing was praying again. I was praying in my relationship. I'm not saying my relationship was the reason why I wasn't connected to God, but I just felt guilty in my relationship with God. So I didn't pray as much. I didn't pray like I should have been. Like the only time I was praying is when there was a problem and that's never good. You should always pray. Like I, I know that you should always pray whether you, you got a problem with God, whether, whether you're sad, you're happy, you're doing good, you're doing bad. Like you should always pray. And the thing is, it's not like I've never been into praying and never into God. I've always been a, into God. I've always been a, a, a child of God, spiritual person. So like in my relationship, I wasn't praying. I didn't have that Holy Spirit in me like I used to, you know. One minute I'm cool, one minute I'm crying, one minute I'm super happy, I'm feeling good. And then the next hour or the next day I'm like crying and I'm sad and yeah, and I think that's part of me growing into a better person, growing into becoming a better person. Because what I ask God is that it was genuine and it was real in me becoming a better person, not no fake anything. So I feel like he's giving me the realness. Like, no, you don't just grow and think that you're just going to be happy. It's going to be candy and lollipops and flowers and all that. Like, no, you're going to have to go through some, some tears. You're going to have to have some breakdowns. And... Monday actually I had a breakdown like I was really like not feeling anyone I didn't feel like talking to anyone I didn't feel like doing anything like um I, I was not feeling anyone but as soon as I prayed I felt so good I still felt so much better after like I prayed like multiple times that day but then yesterday I was feeling good I was feeling happy but then I just got outside of myself and I tried to talk to heck of different people like try to be like a, a pimp like a hoe and I realized that's not me you know but then today, for example, um, I cried. Did I cry? Yeah, today I cried. I prayed. I told God, like, like I know this is not me. I just, I want to focus on myself, not try to go back to trying to talk to all these different types of people and do all that type of stuff. That's not me. That's not, that's not how I am. I just need to really focus on myself. Like, I've deleted social media. So, like, when I upload videos, I'm probably just going to tell people on social media, like, okay, da -da -da, I'm uploading, da -da -da, and that's it. And then just delete the app after that was my plan to do it from the beginning, but I kept going back and forth between talking to people and working on myself. So now that I've prayed, now that I've really thought about it and really truly meant it, I'm really gonna try to work on myself. So yes, I've, I've deleted social media, I've deleted all that type of stuff. And I feel like that's best for me because that's the first thing I go to is social media. And I, I've like, right when I start working on myself and I start trying to grow, I realized that social media is so, negative to me like right when I get on that app I just feel like negative like a negative spirit on me I don't know why it's just something that I do I'm not trying to be dramatic even I'm not trying to be like heck of holy but really that's how I feel um I realized that focusing on myself was the best thing that I could have done um gaining my relationship with God again was the best thing I could have done um it feels good now I'm not only working on myself spiritually um mentally I'm trying to 
think more positive i'm trying not to curse as much it's hard though but each time that i do curse i do think about like that was unnecessary like it wasn't necessary to do that um i'm trying to work hard. i'm trying to get out that lazy lazy um mindset because i told y'all before that i do have a lazy mindset whether it's like doing homework working out anything youtube videos it's a lazy mindset so i'm trying to get out that mindset i'm trying to eat healthier exercise my coach thank god my coach has came in and she's come through and she's given us workouts to do for like two months until summer hits and then we actually start you know hopefully when this uh coronavirus ends then we actually start working out so it makes me feel better after i do them you know like actually yes she had, we started tuesday yesterday and i'm hecka sore i'm really sore like everywhere like arms up here abs that's gonna be coming in legs everything i'm like hecka sore and it feels good like i like being sore so She's do, giving us these workouts. I'm trying to drink more water. I'm trying to eat healthier because I am trying to lose weight. Um, part of the problem I have when it comes to eating healthy is like I crave like for sweet things or chips. Like, I love candy. I love chips. So I'm trying to really work on not eating so, so much of that. Drinking more water. Um, I'm just focusing on me. I'm becoming a better person, I feel like. And though I'm having my breakdowns every now and then, I feel like that's part of me growing because I ask God to make this focus on myself I asked him to make it real and genuine because I've tried to do the whole focusing on myself like junior year beginning of junior year I tried to be all nice or not beginning of junior year um 2019 right when 2019 started I'm like okay it's a new me I'm gonna be nice I'm not gonna curse we're gonna do all that and I tried to do that like for like two weeks and then I realized it was not real it was not me and I, I went right back to my old ways so that's what's been going on with me y'all um it's a lot it kind of it, it sucks for me because i don't like crying i keep telling god like i don't want to think about the person anymore because i think about them all the time it's like how could you not you know i want to text them all the time it's like all that type of stuff i want to do but then it's like no you gotta you gotta focus on yourself and i know not to <sighs> this is a lot i had such a hard time y'all between telling y'all this because i'm like i do not want to tell people my business like that even though i'm beginning that many views we got that. I don't get that many likes. I don't get that many comments. I don't get any of that. I may not get any of that type of stuff, but once it's out there, it's out there. Anybody can see it. No matter if I delete it or not. You know, that's what they say. Watch what you post because once it's out there, it cannot be deleted. So I really, <laughs> I kept going back and forth between telling y'all this or not. I realized that you can tell them that you got a relationship with You ain't got to tell them what happened. You ain't got to tell them who it was with. You ain't got to tell them any of that. So that's all i'm telling you i just got a relationship not that long ago mentally it's kind of draining on me because it was my first relationship so it was hard on me um and that person was like my best friend so it's crazy how you can go from talking to your best friend every single day to not talking to him anymore You're like yeah you miss the person a lot oh my gosh I'm about to cry. <laughs> thinking about it yeah i miss them a lot so i'm not gonna cry <laughs> i don't care bro. i ain't doing it bro i'm not doing it go back in bro yeah, 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 go back in. I'm talking to my tears. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm crying. Oh, I did not want to cry. I could cut this out, but I'm probably not. <laughs> but yeah, um, oh, it sucks. Breakups suck. Even though I'm the one that broke up with the person, I try to get back with the person. The person didn't take me back, but it's okay. The person didn't take me back, but I feel like that's a sign from God telling me that you need to work on yourself you need to focus on yourself as y'all see i cry every little thing i ain't tell y'all i'm like a baby i'm very sensitive i'm big but i'm sensitive so <laughs> i don't know mentally i'm really trying to um forget about the person you know it's hard of course duh like especially depending on how long you've been with them i was with that person for seven months so yeah it's freaking hard yeah what you think yeah it's gonna be freaking tough for me to just oh bye just forget about the person like they, nothing happened you know so yeah it's a lot of talking just now anyways i'm sorry i'm not as enthusiastic as i usually am but uh it's, it's, a, it's a little sensitive topic for me right now y'all i am working on myself mentally physically um like i said my coach Coach D, bro. Shout out to Coach D. She's having us do workouts, and I really appreciate it because she didn't have to do it. A lot of coaches don't do this when it comes to off season. That's what we call it because we're we're out of season for basketball. Obviously, every season is out. Every sports season is out. But um, I really appreciate it a lot because we're working out 
every day. Um, today we just did dribbling. I felt good. Yeah, just dribbling. It was hard. It was difficult, but it felt good. And mentally, I had to tell myself to keep pushing, keep going, keep trying. Cause usually, sometimes like when I mess up and like keep messing up, I just start giving up. But you kept, I kept going. So it felt good. Yeah, I'm reading the Bible. I'm trying to, trying to understand God. You know, as I'm reading the Bible, I'm getting closer and I'm understanding God. You know, um, I'm drinking more water. I'm eating healthy. Like today after workout, man, after practice, after a basketball practice, I would have went, got myself a nice big old like sandwich, something, but instead I, I eat fruit, had some some almonds. And that feels good, you know? That feels really good. Like it feels good to eat healthy, it feels good to drink my water, all that type of stuff. My skin's kind of clearing up. I, I found my glasses. It's like the best thing. Like as I'm working on myself, there's lots of things going on i just feel like it's a roller coaster and that's okay i feel like that's a part of my growing all right y'all so i'm sorry that i've been gone um i'm sorry that i'm not as enthusiastic as i usually am but now that you guys now that i explain it to you guys you guys get a better understanding of what's been going on i feels good to really like tell y'all keep it real with y'all keep it 100 with y'all so if you guys like this video make sure you like comment subscribe don't forget to turn your post notifications on to get notified when i have a video and we'll see you guys later love you bye Thank you.